Shalom Israel uh, Just wanted to talk about uh, You know The way uh, You know the, the way brothers move in his faith A lot of times You know Honestly like I'm a brother that deals with a lot of uh, A lot of shit that I don't tell y'all on camera And uh, One thing that I want to let y'all know is be there for one another, man. You don't know how important it is, you know, for uh, for brothers to really be there for one another when we need each other. Sometimes it'll, it'll literally be the difference between life and death, and you don't even know it. You won't even know it. You probably never know. It'll probably be some shit, like you might save a brother life, He be right there, ready to kill himself or some shit. And you will be the one to tell him the right thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, really, it really be like that sometimes, man. It really be like that sometimes. Like, a lot of people, believe it or not, man, it's, depression and anxiety is real, man. People don't value life. People don't value their own life. People don't value the lives of others. And depression is real. You know, you see a brother drink a lot, the depression is real. Believe what I tell you. You see a brother that drink a lot, you see a brother that, that struggle with certain demons. You know, drinking demons, uh, you know, cigarette demons, not me. <laughs> but uh, I'm just saying, you see brothers out there that, that struggle with smoking. They might be really fighting that smoking demon, you know what I'm saying? You know, you, you want to be mindful of that. You know, nowadays you got perks, Vicodins, and Mollies, and all, all, the, all these other drugs and things out there that's available to help people cope with the pain. There's a lot of pain. And it, it becomes more difficult when you're in this truth. Because we're the ones nobody wants, man. We're the ones nobody gives a fuck about. Or, or very few people give a fuck about. You know, in life, you you sometimes realize you really are alone. And, and the worst part about it is you in this truth, you would think you're not alone in this truth. You got so many other Israelites. Man, listen, even Israelites, we're alone. A lot of times you'd be surprised how, how our own fellow Israelites treat us, man. You know, and I'm not saying that to discourage anybody from coming into the faith, but we have to be honest. You know, the the we we deal with the same shit y'all deal with. The only difference is we know why we dealing with it. That's the only that's the only difference. By the way, I'm not praying or prophesying, so I don't. I'm keeping my my head, you know, my hat, whatever on. But uh, I always have to say that disclaimer because motherfuckers will be like, oh, how, how can he teach what I? Yeah, because I'm not praying or prophesying. You know, uh, it's not about me being proud or nothing. That's just what it is. You know, a lot of times brothers don't read the Bible. They just go off of their own conceit. They go off, off of what, what they think. You know, but nonetheless, you know, uh, like I said, man, my message to y'all, if you see a brother going through it, man, be there for him. You know, it doesn't take a lot out of your day, man. You know. It, it, you, like, like I said, you could literally be saving a life and you don't even know it. But uh, that's all. That's all I got for today, man. You know, I mean, I got a lot, but at the same time, it's like you know, I'm driving. You know, I'm not exactly able to pull scriptures while I'm driving. You know, but uh, but just be encouraged and be encouraging. You know, the, the door swings both ways. You know. Be a brother. Be brotherly. And, 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 you know, just be around brothers that are real brothers, man. You know, with that, Shalom.